So today we got some disc golf news, first of all that Niklas Antela is extending with Discmania and is now gonna be part of the Sky team and he signed a contract for 2024 to 2027 and I think this is really good to see that he sticks with Discmania and honestly I'm quite excited to see more of those Antela PDs as well. In some other news that's a little bit controversial and has had mixed response so far, Christian Tatar is now sponsored by PATH which is an online casino. So this has me quite torn because first of all well, gambling isn't good you know gambling companies is something in general you want to stay away from because it basically makes money of people getting addicted to gambling on the other hand it is great to see Kristin get this kind of support from huge companies in Estonia even in countries like the US even though that's where disc golf is arguably the biggest it's still an extremely small sport compared to many other sports simply put but in Estonia Tatar is basically being treated like any top athlete would in any of the big sports which is great to see so as much as it's not great to see a gambling company get involved in disc golf it's still a great step when it comes to disc golf becoming an even bigger and more mainstream sport in europe but i'd love to hear what are your thoughts on gambling companies stepping in and sponsoring players also if you guys are interested in picking up some cool and unique disc golf apparel now that the season is starting off soon consider checking out my website at discmerch.com